Hey everyone, it's Slumfer, back here again. Today we're going to do be doing two horror games by a, made by a creator known as Zed Technician. We're going to be playing The Bitmore No Zero and The Man in the Window. Some of you may or may have not already seen these games before. I know a good few other people who are much larger and popular than me have gotten to this game, these games long before I have. You know, I know Markiplier played it, I know Daco played it, all these other people, all these other people who also do horror stuff and play horror games here and there, but I'm not gonna really let that dissuade me, and I'm just gonna play these things, so we're just gonna let, get right into these things. Mm. That is a character model. What? What do you want? On Sandra? Yeah! Mom says she can't serve dinner until you get here with the turkey. She wants me to tell you to hurry up. Do you know how early I had to get up to cook this thing? So I don't want to hear it. Next time she can come out here and get it herself. Dot, dot, dot. Now she just wants me to tell you to stop yapping and drive. Oh, jeez, Rick. Hey! Then you can tell her when I get there, I'm going to shove this turkey right up her. Shoot! You okay? No, I ain't okay, boy! There's something up with the car! Dang thing just up and died on me! Hello, Aunt Sandra? Are you still there? You can't hear me or something! I need you to call Toe right! Click. Doggone it! Uh... Now we are here. Ah, Bikini Bottom. I ain't staying here till someone decides to show up and help. Gonna have to walk the rest of the way myself. I ain't gonna be, ain't gonna be like no more by the time I head up that road though. Better settle on in cause it looks like I'm staying here till morning. Ah, uh, Goo Lagoon. We're not. We're not in Goo Lagoon. We're not. We're not in Texas anymore, boys. Wow, it's just a deer. Just a little old deer. Nothing too bad. Nothing too scary. Hmm. Well, we're just sitting here. Deer as the deer has crossed the street. No sense in staying up all night, I guess. Better get myself asleep for a little bit. What in the world? I don't like the sound of that, not one bit. <laughs> of course she has a fucking shotgun in the back of her car. Whatever it is, it had better stay itself in the woods if it knows what's good for it. And if it doesn't, I'll have sure I'll and if it doesn't, I sure have something ready for it. Aha. Uh -huh. Yes, now I'm just in the back of the car with a shotgun. Because, of course, this woman has a shotgun in the back of her car. 
Oh. Who's step, step, stepping on heaven's door? It's just a deer. A little, a little deer, a little guy. It's just another deer that's running. Nothing, nothing too bad, nothing too scary. Just stuck here in the back of the car, looking around for any, for any little creepy peepers, for any little little piggy blinders. I saw that thing. I shot at it. There was a little guy standing over there, down there, at the end of the trail. A little man watching me. <laughs> Scared me. What was that? Some kind of White Walker? Holy! Ran out. He gone down there. Ran out that way. Deer. Little spooky guy. Little spooky man. I see you over there. Get out of here. Go on, get. Okay, so he ran off that way last time. He was just standing there, so I feel like he's going to show up somewhere on this side again. Someone standing. That's just a deer. Who, man, getting kind of sleepy over here. Oh, the deer scared the fuck out of me. What if I doze off with that thing out there? I, ain't, that ain't going to go in too well for me. These next few hours ain't gonna be easy. When falling asleep, tap space repeatedly to wake up. See a little guy charging up on me. I'm just stand there. You weirdo. Oh, next thing you're gonna start standing up and, and bang your head against rocks and stuff. There's something weird. That, you know, one of those weird deer things that deers do. When things aren't just ain't right in some areas.
Get out of here. If he's gonna run up on me, all I have to do is look to where the running noise is coming from and see if it's gonna be him or not. What time is it? 4.40 a.m.? Damn. I'd be dead by now. I can't stay up like this. Even even if I was terrified. Well, I don't know. Oh! Ah, uh, got it. That thing so fucking shows up just scares me. Oh no, he's coming back! I have three shells left, and I've only been shooting him, and it's 5.46. I don't know how long this shit lasts. I don't know if I'm going to be able to survive. It's a deer. Quick mash the space button. I don't see him anywhere in the woods. No, it's a deer. <laughs> no, get out of here. Go on, shoo. I almost got my trunk open, little bastard. I didn't even notice him until I turned around and saw him lifting the thing up. He snuck up on me. Almost. Well, now it's just quiet. Come on, mash that space one. <laughs> oh, fuck. God damn it. It just scares me every time it fucking shows up out of nowhere. I'm not... Like, I hear him running up, but I don't expect to just see him there. 6.03 a.m. now. Ah, uh, fucking god damn it. I don't expect... Well, now I'm out of bullets, and I can't do anything anyways. God damn. Scares the fuck out of me every time I see him. He's just fucking sitting there, and I don't even hear him. Well, now I don't have anything. So now I just gotta sit here. I'm out of bullets, and I've only used my bullets to shoot him. Not any of the deer, not a single one. I'm just going to sit here because he's inevitably probably going to show up and ruin my day. And I don't want to look at him because he scares me. It's starting to become daylight though. So maybe I might make, out of th make it out of this alive. Six fifty one, six fifty two. Okay, it's just a deer. Well, I think it's light enough now for me to go ahead and make a run for it. Damn, she can run. Did he just want the turkey that was in there the whole time? Uh. Room, room. You motherfucker stole my car. That man stole my goddamn car. 
Well, that was an unexpected ending. Got a little star. That's cool. So, anyways, that was the first game. So, we're going to get right over to the man from the window. And we'll start up things when we get there.